The Nkurenkuru Local Authority approached the Roads Authority for assistance towards this cause. Under the agreement, the Roads Funds Administration will be responsible for availing funds, while the Roads Authority will assist with engineering services. The Nkurenkuru Town Council completed the 800-meter road last year, funded by the RFA at a cost of $3.9 million. And we are so happy that today we are signing that. Ours is to ensure that we have a, an effective, safe and efficient road sector in the country. When uh, we are rated as a country to be having the best quality roads in Namibia. Lutombi says his office will ensure that the agreement is fully implemented and they will provide all technical support towards the realization of the objectives. The chief executive officer of the Nkurenkuru Town Council, Petrus Sindimba, says the council has identified 13 roads equivalent with a combined 11,4 kilometers that need to be completed within three years. My expectation is that if we really need to be action oriented that this memorandum of agreement should be of the nature of implementable. And as I've said, we have already started. We did not go into detail in identifying the roads because the road authority told us that no, the, the, the road, we can only start identifying them after we are signing this memorandum of agreement. Sindimba commended the two parties for working together to develop the road infrastructure of the region. The Minister of Works and Transport, John Motora, advised against diversion of funds. We do not want this thing if the money is meant for the road in Kurenkuru. Of course, there are many other needs. Don't divert. Don't divert it. Try to work hard and see how you can get. It. Because this diversion brings problems. You divert this money to something else, but when the population stand up and complain, ah, don't you know that part, the government has not made money? It's not good. The Chief Executive Officer of Roads Funds Administration, Ali Ipinge, stated that RFA has over the past three years increased funds to the local authorities. This year, RFA availed $250 million to the local authority. Elizabeth Mwengo, NBC News, Kurenkuru.